Hey guys, what's going on? I uh, just wanted to post a video here of the progress of the overclock on my uh, Intel Pentium E2140 that I bought uh, off eBay here about two weeks ago or so. Uh, right here you can see the general specs. This is CPU-Z. Uh, you can see I'm um, at 1.288 volts under 100% load. It's a 65 nanometer chip. As you can see, 2140 at 1.6 stock. This is a L2 revision, which the thermal limit is 60.4 degrees, I believe. So as you can see, there's some other technologies below that. There's real temp. As you can see, there's our temperatures. Our full load. Room temperature right now is close to 80 degrees, if not a little bit higher than that. It's very warm in here. And I'm running the... Thermal Right Ultra 120 Black. It's been lapped. The CPU has also been lapped. And I'm running a Silverstone fan on the lowest setting, which is about 40 to 50 CFM. The temperatures don't look that bad. They're actually a little bit lower because I'm running the webcam right now, so I can't devote 100% to the. Let's see, moving on up, you guys can see I'm running that. Been running this for 51 minutes here, almost 52. Running large FFTs, priority five. I don't really think it matters too much as long as you don't have any other things running while you're doing it. Which I'm running a few things right now, but this isn't going to be my maxed out overclock, so I'm not too worried about it. So here is the speeds we're running right now. Two point six six gigahertz running three thirty three by eight rated FSB is thirteen hundred and thirty three megahertz. Let me uh, show you the memory here. Run a memory at one to one, which is according to the SPD here. Main board is our BioStar T Power I forty five. And uh, that's got just the installed BIOS that it came with, which is the very first one, I believe. There's some more specs of the CPU. It's only got one megabyte of L2 cache, which helps keep temperatures lower. And we're shooting for 3 gigahertz plus here, 24-7. And as you can see, my voltage is still really good. So as long as I can keep these temperatures here below 65 or so, because I'm not really worried about this chip too much. But yeah, so far our highest temps were 57. And uh, I installed the stock cooler, and on the stock cooler, uh, the temperatures were at 2.4 gigahertz. And stock voltage, which is one notch lower than what it's at right now, I got, uh, what was the temperatures? 65, 66. And the room was a lot cooler then. That was on a stock cooler that had been lapped as well because I love lapping stuff. So, all right, guys, that's the uh, that's the update there. So, thanks for watching. Uh, I'm gonna probably shut this down here after we hit an hour because we are almost there, 54 minutes and counting. So, once I hit an hour, I'm gonna restart. We're gonna switch a few settings out and uh, we're gonna shoot for three gigahertz here in stock volts. Well, one notch above stock volts. Uh, I mess with some of the chipset voltages when I get a chance. Uh, I don't have any batteries from my other camera that I can take some BIOS uh, videos of. I'm just using the webcam now. More updates later, guys. Thanks for watching.